everything. And this is obviously not the way you guys wanted to come out and play. Yeah, I mean, we got to go back and watch film and see the mistakes we made and try to get better. Tell, tell me a little bit about your pick at the goal line now. Uh, first, I want to thank God and I want to thank the 49ers for giving me the opportunity to play and uh, to be able to start. And uh, it was just a good call by Coach Sala. Got us in a good, a good uh, defensive play call. Uh, we expected pass, and I just, I just able to make a play. There are about 30 new players on this team. Do you think maybe that has something to do that this team still needs to build that chemistry and work together? Uh, like I said, we just, we just want to get back and watch film and see where we made mistakes and try to correct them. Overall, how would you grade the defense's performance today? Uh, I feel like we played really well, and also we, we gave up some big plays and look at film. Once we look at film, see. See what happened and just get better. Spirit, after that, Ruben went down with the injury. I mean, they didn't waste any time. They went right after you guys. Do you almost feel, I mean, was there a letdown to see you know, a teammate on, on the ground and struggling with the injury? Uh, I wouldn't say a letdown. I mean, but Rubes, he's a big part of the defense. And uh, to see him go down, it's, you know, it's, it get to you. But at the same time, we, uh, we stayed together. What does it say about a rookie, though? He goes down with an injury. It didn't appear that he was going to come back in the game, but he's right there on the sidelines with you guys. I mean, for a rookie, that's quite impressive. Oh, yeah, that's rude. I mean, that's, that's just what he do. He's, he's, uh, he has a, a crazy personality, exciting personality, and that's why everybody loves him. Did you think you could make that catch on the interception? Yeah, I mean, once it's in the air, I, I know I got to get the ball. That's, that's, all my mind. that's always my mindset. Do you practice like, going up and trying to grab it one-handed like that? <laughs> no, nah, it was just instincts. And, and were, you, were you surprised you came down with it? No, not at all. Once I jumped and I saw it, I was like, yeah, this mine. And then you tried to take it to the house? Yeah. How close were you from popping uh, <laughs> I, I want to say my teammate tripped me up. I'm going to be mad if it was I tripped up over the grass. So. A lot of penalties today on both sides of the ball. Is that maybe just part of the growing process for this team? Or at the same level you're sitting down. Um, this is obviously not the way you guys wanted to come out and perform in your first game. Yeah, I mean, um, we had to come back together, look at the film, uh, try to get better, look at our mistakes, come together as a team. Um, you know, but it's just on to the next one, you know, <clears throat> one day at a time. Uh, you know, you got 24 hours to think about this one, then you just got to flush it, and you just got to focus on the next game. Uh, really looking forward to play Seattle, and uh, you know, just really looking forward to get on to this next week. Looks like maybe the timing may have been a little bit off between you and Brian. How much does the fact that, you know, you guys are, there's about 30 new players on the team. You guys are just kind of starting to gel. How much of that has a factor? I mean, we've been together since the spring. So, uh, you know, we've gotten chances to, uh, you know, run routes together, get on timing. You know, we went down to Texas and ran routes there, you know, before camp. So I think uh, timing's, you know, we're working on it. And, uh, you know, I think it's going to come. Um, I think it is there for a lot of things, so you know we just got to keep grinding and just got to keep pushing. As a rookie, um, looks like there was one formation issue with you, and uh, just little things. As somebody that's just getting accustomed to all of this, were there challenges on the field as far as just making sure you were at the right place at the right time and just doing those minor things? Oh, um, yes and no. I mean, I got to know my stuff. Uh, they're relying on me. I'm not going to use you know be mean a rookie as an excuse. So I take full responsibility for you know wasting the time out on that one drive. Um, so that's on me, and you know, that's just something I have to focus on. I have to get you know, back into the playbook, you know, back into our game plan, and uh, so uh, that mistake never happens again. In the first half, how much did the penalties and those sacks on one sack on each of the first four drives? How did that kill you? I mean, you know, sacks are drive killers, so uh, you know we just gotta try to do better. And that's really all you can do. You know, you got to come together as a team, like I said. You just got to look at our mistakes and you know, what they, uh, you know, capitalized on. And um, we just got to make sure we don't do that again. You guys went for fourth down a couple of times in the first half. That was fun. Yeah. <laughs> I, think, I enjoyed that. Is it shows in confidence in college and confidence in you guys to get into those yards from four and three? Hundred percent. You know, the fact that Coach Shanahan keeps us on the field to do that it means that he believes that you know we're going to make those. And we got to. He's putting his trust in us, and so we got to perform for him. And uh, you know, we're going to look at you know what we did wrong, and we're going to come back, and we're going to get those next week. Do you think those plays help shift the momentum a little bit? I mean, what kind of stuff you guys do? Oh, I mean, yes and no. I feel like you know we should have made those, but you know, giving them good field position, we, you know, our defense played them. I think they played really, really well today, the entire game. Um, they were on the field too long, and I think that's on us. So. That's really just on the offense. We have to come together and really, really focus and you know try to be on the field long and get some first downs, stack those on top of each other, 
make sure we're not killing our defense by the third quarter. Right. Thanks, George. The game seemed to start off great for the defense and for you in particular. Yes, sir. I mean, just before the injury, how did you feel about the way the defense was playing and how you guys were playing? I felt great, man. Um, you know, it's uh, sad that, um, you know, I had a nick in the, uh, in the ankle. So, you know, that's a, that's a big disappointment. Um, but um, overall, I think the defense, when we came out, we, we had the right mindset. It looked like you were in quite a bit of pain. Was it pretty scary when you were down there on the ground? It was it, it was it was hurtful, but you know, as as the game went on, it started getting looser and and better. How important was it for you to then come out of the locker room and, and spend the rest of the game on the sideline? No, it was it was hard, you know, just to um, watch the players out there um, having fun playing football. But at the end of the day, um, like a lot of guys um, harp on me um, about it, is um it's a long season, so. Um, you gotta do what's right and do what's best for yourself and um, the team too. Just know they're gonna need you um, down in the future. You have a feeling for how much time you're gonna miss? Mm, nah, it's, it's not. It's not that um, horrible. But um, I'll, I'll be back soon. Very, very, very soon. <laughs> It looks like you were doing some minor drills out there. Did you want to get back? Did you lobby to try to get back in the game today? Yeah, yeah. I, I wanted to get back um, out there. Um, you know how injury come um, occurs and. Um, as you know, a couple of hours or so, a couple of minutes pass by, you start getting that feeling back, so you can um, finish the game. And I started um, to feel that um, feeling. And but you know, Niners being the Niners, you know, trying to protect their players. When, when you first came came off on the cart, how how bad did you think it might be? Were, were you fearing the worst at that point? Um, it was pain, um, a little scared, but at the same time. Um, Trust me, if you if you can't put no pressure on it, then you should be worried. But um, if you put a little pressure on it, you got some hope. So um, that's all I was just hoping for because it was painful, but at the same time, um, I knew nothing wasn't um, serious damage. A near pick again. When are you going to get one of these? <laughs> oh, my God. I, I need to go and get me one. I, I, it's, it's calling me. It's calling for me. But... Um, um, it was it was great. It's, it was a great game plan. Um, how we prepared for it, um, I knew it was coming. So I just didn't know like that's Cam Newton. You know, he's he's great at you know checking down something, or he sees something. He's he got great like reactions just to do something else. So I really wasn't expecting the ball just to come straight to me. But you know, it, it is what it is. I guess the ball got a thing for me still. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks for Thank you. Hi, Solomon. How was it playing against McCaffrey, your old teammate, and getting hit on him? You know, it was, it was great to play against Christian. He's a great player. He obviously showed it today, and they have a great team. And it was um, good to get the first game out of the way. You know, now we know what we need to improve on. It's going to be fun getting better next, next week and get ready for Seattle. I think your first NFL hit was against your old roommate. Well, did you, was that, was that the case? Uh, I didn't really notice. Uh, I was just, just trying to do my job and play for my team. And, you know, after the game, we'll talk about it with him, and I'll call him, laugh about it. We'll have a good time. But, uh, you know, uh, now it's just time to improve on this game and improve on myself and my play and how I, need, how I need to do better for this team. Can the defense take solace in the fact that you guys didn't give up any long drives today? Their two touchdown drives were pretty short. You know, we had it. We had it. We played, I thought the defense played well as a whole. But we definitely need to do better um, off of uh, turnovers and Stopping that, but um, you know we, uh, you know we, we're a great defense, and you know we can prove it and we can show it, and uh, it's going to be a, a long, fun year with these guys. A lot of youngsters on this team, a lot mm -hmm. of excitement coming into this game. I mean, what was the atmosphere like for the young, the rookies like yourself getting ready for this game? You know, you know, I was nervous, but you know, it's a blessing to play this game. It's when a dream come true. You know, I was good, nervous. It was just excitement, ready to play. You know, we were pre prepared, and uh, we just need to execute better and play better. I try to play it average. You know, there's a lot of things I need to improve on. My hands, you know, rushing from the edge, you know. But uh, that's what these coaches are here for. This is what my teammates are here for. You know, I'm blessed to be uh, around all the, the best coaches and the best players. And so it's going to be fun getting better and improving what we can do on the field. You and McCaffrey swapped jerseys at the end. Was that something you guys arranged before the game? Or it was just happened we just knew it was going to happen. You know, he's, <laughs> he's one of my best friends in the world. He's my roommate. You know, uh, play with him at Stanford. You know, had a great time with him. And, uh, we just knew it was going to happen. How anxious were you to maybe put a hit on him the first time? You know, I've been anxious since we've been holding him out of practice at Stanford, so it was good to finally get a hit on him. Yeah. How did you feel when you finally got a hit? Did you feel bad? Or were you... 
<laughs> no, I mean, I'm just, I'm just playing football, doing my job, playing for my team, and that's just how it is. So, um, you know, it was fun, it was cool, but, you know, it's time to get better now. Did you oh. talk to Christian at all after the game? After the game, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah we just, swat, just, just, just say, hey, man, I love you. You know, let's yeah. keep, let's own this league. Let's keep getting better each day, and um, let's live our dream. How special is it sharing a pro debut with him? Oh, what did you say? How special is it sharing the pro debut? You with know, it was pretty cool. You know, old teammates, you know, both going the first time we played against each other first game. Uh, you know, it's a blessing to play this league every day. You got, got to take advantage of it. And, you know, I'm just here to get better from each day on out. All right, guys. Thanks. All right, thank you. Thank you.